Hey, Parcel Jutsu here, and uh, this is usually when I would film my live reaction to the new chapter of One Piece, but uh, Shonen Jump is on break, uh, and I think after that chapter of One Piece, uh, I think we all need a break, because holy shit, Kaido, <laughs> Kaido decapitated Orochi, oh my god, and like, <laughs> like, who knows what's going on with Kanjiro and Kiku, and uh, Kaido Big Mom are going to turn the entirety of Wano into a pirate nation. Oh, shit. Um, yeah, so I've been going to do something a little different here and um, talk about the daughter of Kaido, or um, the self-proclaimed son of Kaido, Yamato. And, um, you know, like, she seems, uh, you know, we've got to, we've got to know her just in a couple chapters. <laughs> she's be, become quite the fan favorite character. She's, she's strong. She's, uh, she's strong willed. She has a dream, you know, Odin's dream. And, uh, you know, she wants to sail with Luffy and, um, you know, and, uh, but there's been a, there's been a lot of speculation and theories about, you know, the particulars of Yamato, like, uh, like does he? We we he has the shackles, and um, he says that those shackles will explode if he leaves the island. And uh, but some people are thinking like maybe they're actually sea stone shackles, and like um, if Yamato has a devil fruit ability, then those would be in, uh, like inhibiting said ability. Um, so then that got me to thinking: Does Yamato have a devil fruit ability? Uh, to like you know. We, we haven't seen much of him, obviously, uh, but we know he's got the, the strength, you know, similar to uh, his father with the club and everything. But, um, you know, do, does Yamato have a devil fruit? Uh, I like to think that he doesn't, at least not yet. Um, but uh, some people think that uh, there, there's some theories on what devil fruit he might have, and, you know, obviously since, you know, the Beast Pirates, you know, they're thinking, they're assuming um, that it's probably a Zon ability, and I, I would I would agree with that. If, if Yamato does have an ability, it would, it would probably need to be, um, hopefully, a uh, mythical Zon, or at least a Zon. Um, a popular theory is that, um, you know how Kaido, his Delphi basically makes him like Seryu, like the blue dragon of uh, like Japanese mythology, and um, you know also you ha in that lineup you also like the kind of like the Saint Beast from Yu Hakusho. You've got Seryu, Suzaku, the like the the red bird or like the phoenix or whatever. Not the phoenix, but like uh, the crimson bird. Uh, and you've got uh, Genbu and Biako. And Bi uh, Genbu is like the turtle, and Biako is like is the white tiger. And so a lot, I, I see a lot of theories that Yamato has, like, the white tiger Zon fruit. I don't know if that would be, that, that doesn't sound like it would be a mythical do, uh, Zon fruit, just like a regular carnivorous. But, um, that would be cool, I guess, you know, if, if people think that because, you know, because uh, in the legend, like, Siryu, Siryu and Byako are, like, like diametrically opposed um, like, I think, uh, I believe Seryu is, like, the east, and Byako is the west, so they, like, they, they conflict with each other, and, you know, obviously that would go with, uh, Kaido and Yamato, you know, not seeing eye to eye at all. Um, so, you know, a lot of people, that's, like, the popular theory. Another theory that, uh, Yamato has a devil fruit that is not a Zoan fruit, but it's a devil fruit that we, that has been a, Fairly prevalent devil fruit in this arc uh, that seems to be um, MIA right now. No one knows what's going on with the devil fruit. And that's the Toki Toki no Mi, the time time fruit, um, formerly held by uh, Odin's wife, Toki. Um, and so, you know, that's another possibility. I, I also, I mean, I guess it's possible. Like, the Toki Toki no Mi had to go somewhere, but I, honestly, I don't. I don't love the Toki Toki no Mi idea, uh, and, I, and I, I would prefer Yamato have a Zon ability, uh, or preferably a mythical Zon ability. And so I got to thinking, huh, Yamato 
Mythical's on ability. What what could myth, what could his Mythical's on ability be? Hmm. Well, the most likely one would be of, of the character who just died uh, recently, um, Orochi, and his Mythical's on fruit is the Yamato no Orochi. And so <laughs> I got to thinking. If Yamato does not have a Dofu right now, and I, and I don't think Orochi, looks like most people, I don't think Orochi is dead right now, but I do think there's no way he's getting out of this alive. He's going to die for real. And so if Yamato doesn't already have a Dofu ability, wouldn't it be cool if he, if he ate, if he was the next user of the Yamato no Orochi Dofu? And so, like, you know, because, <laughs> like, his father, Kaido, is like the dragon. And so it would be really cool if the son, uh, Yamato, was the or Yamato Orochi. Because it's also kind of dragon, like a mythical serpent. Uh, you know, so that would be kind of cool. And maybe, maybe even if Orochi ends up getting killed, uh, like in the course of the battle, before Kaido's defeated, like uh, this would be pretty quick. But, I mean, uh, you know, who knows? Maybe Yamato could... Find uh, as soon as Orochi is, is killed for real, um, like maybe Yamato could find the, the fruit really quick and eat it, and then like that would allow Yamato to transform into the Yamato no Orochi and aid in the fight against Kaido. That would be pretty awesome. <laughs> Just imagine, imagine like it would be really it would be weird, but it would be kind of cool looking to see like the Yamato version of of. Because, you know, when Orochi transforms, he's got, like, the, the Orochi heads. Like, he still kind of looks like himself, but he's, like, a eight-headed serpent. But, you know, Orochi's, like, a really goofy-looking dude. But, like, maybe if Yamato ate it, like, he would be, like, a more, like, a prettier. Because, you know, Yamato's, like, biologically a very attractive female character. So to see, like, eight, like, beautiful snake heads would be kind of... <laughs> I'd love to see some fan art behind that. I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I just, that would be that would be definitely pretty uh, unique to see like a beautiful eight-headed serpent monster. But you know that would only make Yamato stronger, and he's already strong as hell. So I think if I were to choose a devil fruit for Yamato to have, it would be for him to be the next user of Orochi's devil fruit, and I think that would be you know. I think that kind of using Orochi's power for good in a way. And also using Kaido's power for good, being Kaido's son, having his strength and having Orochi's Del Fruit, I think that would be a perfect like marriage to for like to like kind of redeem the power that oppressed Wano for like 20 plus years. So I just think that would be I just I was thinking about it, that would be a really poetic cool uh direction to go. So, you know, either during the battle or maybe after the battle, like once the dust settles, like, you know, it, I think it, I, I would like for Yamato to eat Orochi's devil fruit after Orochi dies for real. And he might be dead now, who knows, but, uh, you know, I, <laughs> I I highly doubt it. But, uh, yeah, that's just, I just want to make this simple, short video since, you know, there's no, it's not going to be any live reactions this week. Um, so, yeah, just comment what you think about that like what do you think Yamato do you think Yamato has a Delphi already if so what do you think it is what Delphi would you want Yamato to have uh, but yeah just comment that uh, like and subscribe and uh, this is Parcel Jutsu signing out